My name is Dr. Greg Dakin. My specialty is minimally invasive general surgery and bariatric surgery. The main thing that I offer uh, patients is that I will always try to look for a minimally invasive way to perform their surgery, whether you are having a relatively simple hernia operation uh, to something much more complicated like gastric or intestinal surgery or bariatric surgery. We're always striving to offer uh, the least invasive approach to that surgery and we're really successful in doing that. I think that that approach makes for very good patient outcomes, shortened hospital stays, and very quick return to functional uh, activity, normal routine, going to work, and doing the things that you like to do. My medical training is in specifically in minimally invasive surgery. I did a full year of fellowship training uh, to learn how to do advanced surgery uh, with laparoscopic and minimally invasive techniques. Some of my current areas of research uh, are mainly with ways of making surgery even less invasive. Uh, we are striving to be able to perform in surgery with no incisions on the abdominal wall whatsoever. Uh, as an interim step towards that, we are currently uh, performing surgeries with only one incision uh, and using specialized instruments to perform the operations that are currently being done with five, six, seven, eight incisions at times. Uh, in the future, we hope to perform surgery through natural orifices in the body, uh, which will enable us to have very minimal post-operative uh, discomfort. I think that our bariatric practice here, surgery for weight loss, is quite unique in that we offer patients several minimally invasive surgical options for obesity and to try to help them lose weight. Many practices limit themselves to one or two surgeries. We routinely perform four surgeries, uh, all with minimally invasive laparoscopic techniques. I think that this enables us to tailor our operation to what may best benefit the patient. Not all patients are the same and not all patients are going to benefit the same from different operations. One of the things that we found especially is that with patients who have diabetes, uh, in particular when they have gastric bypass, uh, we do see resolution of their diabetes long before they lose a substantial amount of weight. And so this leads into another active area of interest of ours, which is surgery to cure diabetes, even in the patients that are not severely overweight. One of the advantages that patients will have coming to Wild Cornell is that we are a center of excellence. We've achieved the highest level of certification by the American College of Surgeons, so that you know our bariatric patients are going to receive the highest quality care available. Also, New York Presbyterian is consistently one of the top-ranked hospitals, the number one-ranked hospital in New York City, and the number six-ranked hospital in U.S. News and World Reports across the nation.